we doing everyone welcome to another movie review with maca b we have just gotten out of the cinema after seeing ambulance i've been trying to see it for about two or three weeks now uh it's, it's taking some time that's mainly just down to oh, these are reflecting as hell mainly just down to how busy it is at work but let's get on with the actual film i went into this not actually having a damn clue what it was about normally we get a nice synopsis before i go and see a film this one actually had very little describing what was going to happen. But I can't tell if that's a blessing or a curse. The overall aesthetic of the film I quite enjoyed. Because when I looked at the poster, I could tell that the... Because I didn't even watch a trailer for this. I could tell that um, the female was, from the poster was going to be pretty much you know, an ambulance person. And I could tell that the other two were going to have something to do... With a crime taking place inside of an ambulance. That that felt kind of obvious from the title. Though with Jake Gyllenhaal's character. I kind of. I, I thought he was just going to be like. A police response guy. You know on the end of a phone back and forth. Turns out he's like the main man of this. So that was the first surprise. That I actually quite enjoyed. With it being a Michael Bay film. A lot of the action is. Um overdone i'd say that there's some fantastic action uh, fantastic action sequences in this film but it's just there are a lot of angles that were just shot and reshot and like replayed to try and build suspense or something i don't really know what and it, it just kind of it's it it gets overbearing at times i'd say but most of the action sequences that take place and minor twists and things, pretty good. They work pretty well. There are a lot of characters in this film that just don't seem like they actually really serve a purpose. Like for example, there's like this guy. Um, he's the I think he's like the lead, the head of the SIS, like something police related, like you know, like a special unit who just rattles off some rapport with Jake Gyllenhaal at times, but doesn't really. He doesn't feel like he really serves much of a purpose. It feels like Michael Bay is try he's trying to get like five different storylines and not a single one is actually working on its own. But, you know, is what it is. The general idea is that basically bank robberies, po po, shit goes sideways as you'd expect. It don't really work. And it does, in some senses. One thing for me that I quite enjoyed was just that uh, I don't know if it was an intentionally comedic moment or what. But there's a moment, um, this might be a bit of a spoiler, where an injured police officer during this whole ambulance thing is having to be operated on in the back of a moving ambulance. And they're kind of in his guts and he wakes up in the middle of the operation. And so um, it's the ambulance, one of the bad guys and the, the female EMT. And uh, the one bad guy that is helping her just just, just <laughs> tells the cop, go to sleep, and straight twats him in, in the face. It was, I'm not going to lie, th there weren't many people in this screening, because like I said, this film's been out for a while, but it was fucking hilarious. Like, just the way it was executed was probably one of the biggest highlights of the film, which is one thing that really helps my opinion for this one. I think from the main principal characters and actors that we have, we get strong, commendable performances all around. Get a little bit of a psychotic, a little bit of compassion, a little bit of everything that we kind of hope to see, I guess. Which I can't complain about, quite enjoy. So overall, uh, if I'm going to grade this movie, I'm going to give it a, I'll, I'll give it a solid B. There was definitely areas for improvement. Some things that could have been dialed down, some things that could have been dialed up a little bit. But overall, not a bad little effort. Especially since, like I said, I didn't have a clue what the hell I was going into. So yeah, I would, I would, I would recommend in in its few in its final days, if you get a chance to see it, I would recommend checking it out. If not, I'd say once it hits streaming services, definitely one to watch on a Saturday night. But yeah, that's everything I have for you on that one. So until next time, stay safe, have a good day, night, evening, afternoon, or whatever the hell it is, wherever the hell you are. Movie madness, Maccabee, out.